Alright you guys, so today I'm going to be talking about My Hero Academia. Now, if you watch the Anime Man, or if you watch Trash Taste, you might know what I'm about to be talking about. Because they only a little recently started talking about My Hero Academia potentially lasting for another decade or two. You know what I mean? Like, is My Hero Academia going to be one of those long-running anime that lasts for like a decade or two or three you know what i mean kind of like naruto one piece dragon ball etc you know like all the most popular animes is my hero academia going for that sort of run that flow you know what i mean now here are their theories for that number one it's hella popular you know what i mean even though the my hero academia fan base is hella weird and stupid you know what i mean its popularity is definitely at naruto level one piece you know, okay maybe not one piece but you know definitely like naruto one piece that type of shit and my dog is in my closet right now sorry about that but regardless its popularity is the number one reason obviously reason number two it's pacing and the way the show has been running so far now everyone knows that long running anime it typically starts out pretty damn boring even a couple seasons in even a hundred plus episodes in it's not really that fun or interesting you know what i mean i think one piece is a good example of this you know even when you're a hundred episodes into one piece you still feel like you haven't gotten much elsewhere i mean yeah you have introduced us to a few new main characters that's cool and all but it's not like we've gotten to anywhere like great or specific you know what i mean and i think my hero academia it's it doesn't have a hundred episodes yet but it's still kind of having that flow you know what i mean nothing extreme major has happened you know Deku and Bakugo their relationship is a lot like Naruto and Sasuke's relationship you know what I mean and mostly of what we've seen so far is training and typical heroes versus villain fights and even season four had a little bit of more of a focus on the villains than the heroes you know what I mean unlike the first three seasons I mean the beginning of season four it was pretty good I'm not gonna lie but then once it continued it got a little bland I'm not gonna lie but that's okay you know what I mean season five is coming out soon I'm expecting that season to be a hell of a lot better so either ways that's just, just my opinion and I do honestly believe that My Hero Academia does have the potential of lasting for another year or two. Oh, and by the way, go check out that podcast from Trash Taste. And because I do think that they make some valid points, I'll leave a link to it in the description. Is My Hero Academia trying to go for like a a 10 year run here or do you think it's going to be like I they feel, have an ending inside? Yeah, I feel with just how successful it is, I'm sure the people at Shonen and Jump. But without further ado, thank all my brothers for watching and I'll see you guys next time.